organization in your company or organization. Yeah, why, why, yeah. Okay, first thing is about documented uh, implementation. No, wait, 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 wait. Uh, for your information, uh, I work for an ISO consulting firm, the name, okay, and I have been uh, providing consultation for the last five years, I don't know. Okay. okay. For your information, I work with uh, Bureau Veritas certification for the past five years. BV. And BV. Uh, yeah. I mean, the years is not correct. Huh? It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, we work with Bureau Veritas uh, certification for the past five years. For your information? For your information. BV is the number one. Uh, for your information, BV is a France-based company with a 200 over years of history in France and he is the number one partner of uh, certification in industry. He has uh, many core, other core business, uh, some sort, uh, especially in construction and also uh, oil and gas. As for, Earth, as for myself, I will be best in certification industry. Okay, okay. to getting the three important points of getting an ISO certification, the first one, the most important for any organization, you must have a documented documentation. Why? This is to prevent the staff turnover. For example, I give you a case. Most of the factory, you will have a very high staff turnover. Correct? Yeah, okay, correct. Uh, okay. Once, for example, you have a supervisor work for you for the past 15 years, oh. if you don't have the ISO implementation, most of the tasks, most of the job, uh, most of the documents is kept or kept by this uh, supervisor. In his head. In his hands. He's, only, he's the only one who knows the heads and until the tails, the overall, the entire of the operation mm -hmm. floor. But whenever any of the factory or organization you don't implement the ISO certification, uh, you don't have the company policy, you don't have the manuals and all these, whenever this supervisor has Leaves been the head, company. Uh, the, this supervisor has been headhunted uh. by other factory, he will just left leave. He will just leave with everything in his hand. The next person that going to be promoted to the supervisor, he or she is he doesn't he, he or she doesn't know how to continue this task mm. because our company or the organization you doesn't have the documented documentation. So that is the first benefit. Yes, that is the first benefit because in the manual you're going to list out all the procedures from the beginning how you process from the raw materials up until the finishing goods and also the second things how you deliver to your clients mm. so the second thing recently the, uh, recently one of my one of uh, my customers one of my customers called me called me to thank me to thank me due to our proposal and in uh, terms due to the ISO certification due to our Due to the ISO certification implementation. Ah, uh, yeah. My customer thanked me because. My customer thanked me because. One of his supervisors left. One of his supervisor left. And uh, the the new supervisor could immediately. The new supervisor could immediately uh, take over his task or even can perform better than the previous supervisor. Because of the documentation. Because of this all proper documented documentation uh, the second benefit thing, the second the benefit second benefits of, of ISO certification of ISO certification is about business sustainability how most of the SME this uh, uh, small medium enterprise most of the I can say uh, we call it like Chinaman company or any of the organization most of the uh, business we can how to say we can build we can build the business but